Hello everyone, Thunderhunter67, also known as SonarisFan89 on PSN, back with more Ratchet and Clank on the PS4. Apologies since I took a while before I could post this video, but uh, some problems happened and I had to get them sorted out. So now we are on right, Gaspar. Find you a new jetpack. And like Ratchet said, we're here to find Clank a jetpack. Okay, now since we're here, this place is where you can get the walloper from the vendor, but unfortunately they did not put the walloper in this game. Ratchet dreamed of riding that grind rail, which he will do as soon as he finds some grind boots. Okay, that was a, a neat little thing. When I tried to jump on the rail, Rat actually got burned. I didn't know those rails are like superheated. Perhaps the turret could help blast through that door. Great. Reinforced door. Why does everything have to be made of dense alloy? I will try not to be offended by that. In case you don't remember, these turrets were specifically placed here for you to blast through the reinforced doors to continue. Also, there was a skill point pertaining to those ships in the sky. If you shoot down and off of them, you get a skill point, but it looks like it wasn't in this game. I, I even tried. You're seeing me try right now, but those ships are invincible.
reinforcements. Grind boots? A tripad lock. In order to bypass it, the duo would have to quickly activate all three pressure pads. Cool! Grind boots! Oh, look! They got it! Sweet! completely unlikely location is where Ratchet found a shiny new pair of grind boots. With his grind boots strapped on, Ratchet leapt onto the rail. On the hunt for the jetpack, Ratchet used his newfound grind boots to explore the planet further. Good choice! Ratchet acquired a plasma striker. The pseudo-spectral bioscope could identify enemy weak points, but did he have the skill to hit them? Looks like your plasma striker could use an upgrade. Ratchet stylishly left onto the rail next to him. Where did they get this on screen blur effect? Was someone playing a Sonic game? Mines ahead. Ratchet would be able to use this refueling station as soon as he collected the jetpack.
combat. Come here. Don't worry. I'm a friend. I know who you are. You're the Lombax and the Warbot from the news. Oh, and you must be the faceless minion helping Drek terrorize the galaxy. That's just my day job. My real passion is in amateur neuroscience. I've been collecting brains from telepathopuses as a hobby for about a year now. You collect brains as a hobby? I'm gonna go out on a limb here and say you're single. Studying brains is a noble pursuit. If I can tap into the psychic powers of these telepathopuses, I'll be able to raise an army. Then we'll see who thinks they can steal my food out of the company fridge. I mean, I can contribute to the good of all blog kind. Say, if you can collect a few telepathopus brains from me, I'll give you this jetpack. That dude's voice actor, I swear, I heard him before, heard him from uh, Invader Zim and from, yeah, and there I say disgusting. it, Chaos! You got one. Though I don't know his name, but let me just say, he's an amazing voice actor. Tell you what, I actually have a top secret Drek Industries info box. If you bring me a few more brains, I might be willing to part with it. You really have a thing for brains, don't you? Yes, I do. And with that jetpack, Ratchet became the aerial scourge of a thousand thousand worlds. 
Or at least his commute got easier. Don't know what that thing is, but we will find out in the next part. So this has been Thunder Hunter 67, also known as Sun Ace Fan 89 of PSN. Signing off. Remember to subscribe if you like my videos, and I'll see you uh, in the next part. What?